Welcome back. We have my favorite chef in the whole wide world, Chef Jules Wilkins. We're lucky to have her because she recently came off a stint. She's, I, we don't call her a celebrity chef. We call her a chef to the celebrities. And recently you were cooking or helping with the Kid Rock tour? Yeah, down in uh, Louisville, Kentucky. Do you know what Kid Rock's favorite food is? Jimmy John's house. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, he, uh, has, he has his own little. You his know, palate is his palate. Is his palate. Yeah. <laughs> He's a but the rest of the crew is really good, and they loved our food, so Excellent. it's always it's always fun. So I love when you I love talking about the famous people that you get to work with because it's just it's just a fun life you got going, Jewel. Uh, well, I, you know I don't do it that much anymore, but when I do do it, it's a lot of fun. Most of my focus though is right here in Toledo. And that's what we want to talk about first. In a minute, Jules is going to show us how to cook some lamb. Is that right? We're going to do a rack, rack of lamb. We're going to show you how to um, how to French it out and how to just do a basic, simple recipe for rack of lamb okay. and a nice little salad. Which is what I was saying does intimidate me. So that I wanted to get a kind of a basic idea of what to do. But your business is really another great idea for busy families, busy moms. Bella Michi, and it, you started out with the Sauces. I started out with my salad dressings, okay. which I won the SIF contest in 2011. Which is a food business contest here in the Toledo area. Yep. And so, and we're marketing this. I'm in like several markets here in Toledo, Kaz Myers, Sauters, mm -hmm. um, Flicks and Temperance, Howard's and Temperance. And, but um, they're so good. I love the sauces. Oh, Thank there you. we go. A nice labeling too. That looks like an upgrade. It is an upgrade from when I was here before. Pretty. Yep. I like it. Um, so that though turned into this new business that you're yes. doing, Bella Michi Catering. Catering. Well, I've always been a caterer for tw tw for 12 years. I've catered mm -hmm. on the side. You know, I've always been a chef, and then I always had little catering jobs. Well, when Navy Bistro closed down, I went and I did the backstage catering for full time mm -hmm. for about a year, and then the last year, I pretty much just backed off, and I'm doing that part time. And in the meantime. I've really developed my, my catering company. And this is Bella Michi at your door. So pull out what's in this bag. So also this, snazzy bags that people, it keeps them warm. This it's neat I meat developed meat. because okay. I had a sick relative and uh -huh. I was dropping off dinners and I thought, why am I not doing this to as my job? As my job. Okay. So, <laughs> so I. This is my voice in your this, head. Why are you doing it as your job? job. <laughs> so I put it all together and this is where we are. And they so come. So people order. They order online through my website, and you go in every week. Week the menu changes, so you're never going to get bored. It's like you get to do have somebody else create your dinners for you. So perfect. it's perfect. Um, and the nice thing is, is that all my meals are anywhere from eight to twelve dollars. Oh, nice. So we're not talking crazy amounts. I mean, if you go to McDonald's, you're going to spend eight dollars for a combo meal, and you're not even going to get good food. So. <laughs> Here, like this right here is a pull, lemon chicken uh, caper. A lemon chicken caper, and mm -hmm. it comes, this is a single serving. And that's actually 24 ounces is what, that this container is 24 ounces. So you get eight ounces of protein, and then you get about seven ounces of whatever your side is. This has quinoa in it. Um, and then it comes with a side of, uh, this week is asparagus. Oh my goodness, so okay. So this I is what you get for, for $12. Twelve bucks. Mm -hmm. And then there's side salads on the menu. We also have um, uh, soups, and yeah. um, I have kids' meals too. Like this is a complete kids' meal, and you have it's macaroni and cheese, and it's got steamed broccoli in there, and then it comes with a side of fresh fruit. Fruit as so well. So this is taking the mac and cheese up a notch, but in no more difficult way to pr prepare it. I mean, you right. are just zapping this thing in the microwave. Yeah. it's you know two and a half minutes in the microwave and you've got a nice beautiful tasty meal. Now this is the way though a lot of chefs are realizing we want their expertise in our homes. Yep. You know we see these things on TV and we just it seems intimidating to prepare. Um, so here in our area they can go to your website and order and mm -hmm. we just want to mention the website again bellamichicatering.com and that's how you would get this fantastic dinner ready to go and you know you just let them know how long to nuke it is that right? Yep. Yes. And then, um, but it, again, it's a trend that's happening across the country. It is. And talk about that. People want your expertise, but, that, you know, we, we all don't have personal chefs. I know. And I guess I ran across a website in Ann Arbor that was doing it. Mm -hmm. And I went up there and spent a day and found out, you know, she's doing 500 meals a week. So it's, it's kind of growing. And, you know, Ann Arbor is a little bit more, you know, trendy than what we are. <laughs> but I think that Toledo has the concept. We've got people here that would be in, in, interested in this because think about it you've got a husband working wife working the kids got soccer mm -hmm. blah 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 mm -hmm. 
where are you stopping? You're stopping at McDonald's, you're stopping at wherever fast to get fast food. Well, right. what if you just come home, this is dropped off at your door, and then the next week you come back, I pick up the old bag and, and take the and drop a new bag. I love it's that. It's pretty simple. Um, and all you have to, it's all through PayPal, so everything is all, you know, right on the website. If I was, uh, say, watching in Erie, Pennsylvania, and I thought, I want someone by me who does this, what kind of Google search am I doing to find this kind of, I mean, you did a certain amount of research to find these yeah. businesses. What do we look for if, you know, because you're, you're going to be in the area here of Northwest Ohio, but let's say we're in Erie or we're in Corning, New York or Elmira. What should we Google? I, go <laughs> Google I went in when I started looking. I went into... Um, Home home prepared meals. Okay. So I kind of just started googling around with that and started playing around with what you know where to go what's into. Out there? Yeah. What's out there? Uh, dining, you know, um, chef on the way, Th different things like that, and that's what I found out. And there's you know there's a place in Oregon that's getting go going to go national, but it's called Dining Night. Their dine concept, tonight. Dine Tonight. Okay. Their concept is great, except for they only do one meal a day, and you have to get that one. You have to sign up for three months. Mine is. If you want to order one week, you don't order the next week, you're fine. You're not obligated. You, it's more of a commitment. It's more of a commitment, right. But that is an option for people yes. who maybe don't have, uh, what, we know you're going national eventually, right? <laughs> but we'd at like this to. point. <laughs> we'd like to. Absolutely. If At this point, this is where you would get it. It's yeah. in Northwest Ohio. So if I, which one of these were we going to pop in the microwave? We're going to pop this one right here in the microwave. We're gonna, you're going to try this uh, chicken piccata. Okay, so this is going to go while we, uh, Head to our next segment. Um, when we come back, we are going to cook a little bit with Jules because I would be a fool if I got this chef in the kitchen and didn't make something with her. So when we come back, Chef Jules is going to create uh, some lamb for us. Woo! All right. All right.